quick little disclaimer before the tutorial even starts. You can't use hand controllers, just of any kind. Like, I don't know, the ones I have, they just, they don't work. You have to use like a controller like this or something. I don't know, Xbox controller might work. That's about all I can think of. And secondary disclaimer, the computer is going to be making some annoying noises and that's because, well, I haven't fixed up the fan in a while, so got to do something about that. So what you're going to need, a VR setup in general, so, I mean, since you're coming to a video like this, you probably already have something going on, but basically, just anything compatible with Steam VR. For me, it's HTC Vive headset with HTC Vive base stations, but for you, it could be literally anything, just as long as it's a VR setup that works with Steam VR. And you should also have a computer that is sufficient for running VR games with Steam VR, because that is a necessary prerequisite to even using Steam VR. You're also gonna want Minecraft for Windows 10, but like you can you can use the trial version. That's what I'm going to be using, because I haven't bought, like, the full thing yet. Now, literally, all you want to do for step one is go to new, make a shortcut, and type in Minecraft colon slash slash mode slash question mark open xr equals true simply press next and just type whatever name you want and then finish it up and it should automatically display this as the image then simply turn on steam vr and while you're in vr launch this and it'll load in VR. So to give a demonstration, this is the headset. It's already turning on from the game. You might notice it's a white screen because it's going through the loading screen and now it's showing whatever's shown up here. So yeah, that's how it works. And here's the title screen menu, which by the way, um, it takes usually a little while for that to load, but it always loads eventually. Either that it, or it crashes, but it's so quick and easy to load that that doesn't really end up mattering. Also, yet again, you can't use the hand controllers with it. I've tried. No, you, you have to use the Xbox controller, but that works just fine at least. At least you don't have to sit down and use the keyboard. Now if you're wondering, oh my god, how did he figure that all out? I used the official help.minecraft.net site and I looked Minecraft and virtual reality and they, they, they had this. If you're trying to launch it from a VR headset that doesn't have it in its game library, then just do this. That was how I figured it out. Now, another way to do this is to just use Revive, but that takes longer. And there are already a lot of tutorials on that, though. Here's my quick little tutorial on that. Just turn on Steam VR, go to the Steam VR dashboard, and click the revive icon and click Minecraft. Go through the launcher and then play the game. Now, if you want a more legitimate revive tutorial, look up revive tutorial. <laughs> like how to use revive. And no, I've tried, you still can't use the hand controllers with revive. But yeah, anyways, that that's how you do that. Goodbye. <laughs>